At just a few inches long, hummingbirds are some of the smallest birds in the world. But every spring, they make one of the longest journeys. They're already being spotted in the southern U.S. as they travel north, some flying over 2,000 miles. And they don't go by the calendar. Their migration is driven by the weather. Hummingbirds thrive in temperatures between 60 and 90 degrees. That's when they're most active, feeding, mating, and building nests. Too cold, they'll delay their trip. Too hot or stormy, and they'll change course. In the mid-Atlantic and Midwest, expect them to show up in the next couple of weeks. In the Northeast, early May is your best bet. But their arrival depends on how quickly your local temperatures warm up. If you want to welcome them to your yard, start with a simple sugar water feeder. Four parts water to one part sugar. No red dye. Clean it every few days, especially as temperatures rise. And don't stop there. Plant native flowers like bee balm and trumpet vine. These give hummingbirds natural nectar and nesting material they'll need through the summer. And if you don't want to miss a moment, tech can help. Smart cameras like Humming Viewer live stream activity right from your backyard. These tiny flyers may look delicate, but they're tough, even slowing their heart rate overnight to survive spring's colder snaps. So whether you're in the city or the suburbs, now's the time to prep your garden and your gear. For AccuWeather, I'm Allie Reed.